Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm with the best Western over here in Cedar City. It's really nice. You check in at the hotel lobby. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> they have a nice breakfast. Our viewers pay $4 for it. There is a gym area over here. It's open 24 hours. It's just really impressed with this place. It's a small park. Uh, they only have about a dozen or so spaces. There is a laundry room here somewhere for guests. It's their little courtyard area outside. Isn't this is adorable? Look, they have fresh gardens. Apparently, there's a gardener that picks tomatoes and puts it in your burgers when there's ripe tomatoes and tonight between 6 and 9 o'clock they have a comp it's part of the fee so they're calling it a complimentary dinner burgers and, I, and he said a salad so I'm having dinner here tonight one burger is fine with me. So it's complimentary. However, the way I look at things, it's included with the price of your fee. So that's really nice. Nothing's free. The Best Western, it's a, it's a motel, as you can see over here. And here's their RV, RV park. It's, it's, really, it's really small. It starts from there, which is at the end of the street, and it just lines up here to that street. That's it. This is the RV park. Okay, here is space 353. It's got shade, which is nice. Sewer. Water. What the air pitch is. It is 50 amps, which means I can use my heater tonight, the overhead heater. I'm not setting up the sewer, so it being off level a little bit is going to be fine with me. But again, my biggest pet peeve is that you're paying for the space, and the space should be level. Looking at the ground right now, it doesn't look that level. <sighs> Only here for one night. Will not be setting up the sewer. I will be in Vegas tomorrow at the Oasis Campground. The other thing that I've noticed about this RV site is that there is no trash. Oh, a piece of plastic over here, but one little piece. They've done a little good. They've done a good job. Oh, and I guess that's the post office next door. <laughs> I just noticed they're all mail trucks. Okay, we're gonna go check out this free fireside dinner or hamburgers. I don't see anyone in the fireside. Okay, they do have hors d'oeuvre hors d'oeuvre stuff. Apparently it's too cold to be out here, which it actually is. I'm going back to the rig to get a sweater. Uh, they have minestrone soup and chips and veggies that you can snack on, which is not enough for me for dinner. What I did notice was a sizzler <laughs> across the street. So we're gonna have I'm going to have Sizzler tonight, unless there's something else that catches my eye. Okay, so possibly Sizzler for dinner tonight. And this is my last evening sleeping in the rig because tomorrow I will be in Las Vegas. I will be back home in PH1. And Wanda will be at the Oasis RV Park 
where on the following day I've got guys coming from our company with a truck another truck to essentially empty out Wanda and bring everything to PH1 so I can clean and organize it look at this they have a chest set out here we were gonna go across the street to the sizzler instead but we what I discovered attached to this best Western there's a place called Depot Grill Steak and Seafood so Oh, and a bakery next door. This is our walking distance. There's another restaurant over there. It's a pizza place over there. I'm not, run, I'm not really into pizza. This is all just around the corner. This is great. I love this. This is all centrally located. <laughs> okay, an adorable restaurant. Panorama. This is really cute. I'm hoping the food is good. Merlot and Rangoon with bacon, cream cheese. Oh, I don't know what else. It's delicious. All right, dinner apparently includes a salad. Okay, we're having steak. It's normally asparagus, but asparagus triggers my gout. <laughs> so. Hey, one sauce. It's so nice to be back in the United States. Cheesecake. <laughs> I just had dinner over at the Depot Grill. That used to be the old railroad station. And they have since yanked out the railroads and the tracks. The building still remains. It's really cute inside. So it was an excellent meal. The steak was delicious. So was the cheesecake. The Rangoon was delicious. Oh, very good meal. So happy I found that instead of going to Sizzler over there across the street. Now, there is two Best Westerns here. I don't know why. There's one across the street, and then there's this one. This one... I don't even see a sign. It says Best Western on here. Okay, this one has the RV park attached to it. Again, really small park. They got 10 spaces. So I highly recommend that you make a reservation. That's what I did. Really charming place. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, it's called the Best Western Plus. I just found the sign next to this building. So don't go to the Best Western. Go to the Best Western Plus. Thank you for watching. Bye.